Senior Councillor Roysdale Ford, who's challenging for the leadership of the party, the People's National Congress Reform, says that there is a negative attitude on the part of some members of the party. His comments came during a podcast with a Dr. Linda. One of the things that is commonly said is that, you know, you must wait your turn um, in the party. And that is commonly said. And that, you know, the other um, adjoining epithet, the other adjoining statement is that, you know, you just come into the party. Um, these are negative statements which seem to have some sort of um, sustaining power. Sharing the platform with him was former Mayor Obraj Narain. Narain responded to the comment that Ford needed some more experience. When I took the office of the mayor, I mm -hmm. hadn't any experience in public servant, nor political office. You have to give people chance to gain mm -hmm. that. And I know for a fact, self-praise is no recommendation. I've received instruments. I've received a Congress, congressional award of my works that I have done in the city of Georgetown. And experience is something that we gain every day. A man is not, th this man, Roy Zilford, is not only a lawyer. We must understand that he is a senior counsel. Ford contended the mindset of some members is a millstone around the neck of the party. That young people are talented, that young people are mature enough to undertake serious obligations of leadership in the country or even in the party. When we look around the world, Dr. Linda, most of the leaders in political parties now and in um, government are young he people. said that it's a disease of the mind that causes people to believe that one has to be much older to hold leadership positions. I would like the leader of the party currently or anyone with responsibility for the um, for, for, for young people to come forward and, and outline what would have been achieved by the party in relation to young people. What new ideas would have been brought to bear in relation to the resuscitation of the Guyana student and youth movement, which is the, the youth arm of the party. He said that the gap exists. Some young people feel sidelined. Um, a resident of Linden complaining that the only party group, youth group that is active in the party is a retrieve group up in Linden, but that group has not received the necessary approval um, to attend the Congress of the party. Ford said that there is no clear direction for the youths in the party. I believe that young leadership will push back against that gap that exists in the minds of most members of the party who are from a certain period and be able to attract the younger people to the party. You need to change the messaging of the party. You need to change the way in which we go about attracting young people in the party.